Greetings and salutations, everyone. My name is Semantics, and welcome back to Let's Play Until Dawn. Um, I've been really, really anxious to continue this. Unfortunately, I've been sick for the past couple of days, so I haven't been able to, but I'm going to try to record two parts in this session, so I'm just going to jump right back in. Back with this guy. Awesome. Hello again. Ugh, I hate this guy. He freaks me out. And how are we feeling? Fantastic. Seems we hardly scratched the surface in our last session, so let's go a little bit deeper this time. Um. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. All right, then. Hmm. That's a good question. Men worry me or women worry me? They both worry me in their own way. Hmm. You know what? Women worry me. Oh, I love the touchpad stuff. There we go. Um, planes or crowds? Hmm, crowds. Oh, Jesus. Um, I fear both of those things. Uh, <laughs> Christ. Uh, ugh, I don't know which one to pick. All right, you know what? Drowning. It's gonna have to be drowning. Snake or rat? Um, I like snakes, but I wouldn't want to be face to face with one. But I also wouldn't want to be face to face with a rat either. I'm gonna say snakes. All right. Knife or gun? Guns can always run out of bullets. And knives are close combat only, generally speaking. So guns are scary. Okay. Oh, snakes or cockroaches. Oh, it's gonna have to be cockroaches. Can't stand cockroaches. Anything with more than four legs. <laughs> oh, Christ almighty. Clowns. Hands down, clowns. Can't stand clowns. Gore disgusts me. Crows are scary. Um, in the grand scheme of things, I can usually handle gore, at least in movies. But... Uh, yeah, alright. I'm gonna have to go with gore then. Because I don't really find crows that scary. Oh. Christ! Did I startle you? Yeah. So sorry. You're doing very well. Dick! Don't be nervous. A little hard not to be when your creepy ass face. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Okay, fine. Metronome then. Christ almighty. Spiders. It's gonna have to be. Needles. Dude. You're really freaking me out, okay? Zombies or clowns? <laughs> um, still clowns. <laughs> Wolves? Oh, dogs. That's a wolf, that's not a dog. Um, I fear needles more than I fear dogs. Because needles are sharp and pointy. Needles again! Storms do not scare me, unless I'm out in the middle of them. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligent. You're welcome. Uh, don't do that. Spiders, clowns, and needles. <laughs> don't make fun Some of me, dude. Some combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> you are a psycho. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Well, I'm afraid once again we're out of time, but good. I promise. 
We'll talk again very soon. Let's not. Mm. This guy's really freaky. <laughs> Oh, it even shows you where he left off. That's awesome. So here's a little recap for you guys. Did you guys think this is a little bit... Oh, come on. She deserves it. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. No! Shut <laughs> Oh, I hate the crunch sound. First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sister. Good old Hayden Pantier. How did you go find Sam? Son of a bitch. Dun dun dun, drama. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. So, so far, I've played as all of the characters, except, uh, Man, I feel like this Mike gets bigger every time I climb it. and oh, yeah. Emily. That feels the same to me. Josh, Hannah, oh, and Josh. Complex, thoughtful, loving. Complex? Okay. It's kind of a derpy picture. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm... Getting withdrawals already. Yeah. You got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, oh, I think I left it in my other jacket. <laughs> Oops. Hey guys. Get up here, okay? Yeah. Oh, well, more or less, but it is so good to see you. What's up with him? He's pissed because his girl was hugging Mike. Oh, what the hell is going on now? Ugh. Yo, yo, yo. We get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Gossip. Matt and Emily. Um. Hmm. You know what? Chris kind of seems like the type who would gossip. So. Yeah, I'm going to go with that. So Matt and Emily are a thing now, right? Yeah, so it seems. I mean, what's Mike think of that? I have a feeling Mike's already got his hands full, you know what I mean? Huh. Damn it. This freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. So kick Should them in. a window around the corner we can get, like, get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? Yes. <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. What? <laughs> Hi, Chris. Oh, yeah. He has a crush on her. Uh, all confident. Yeah. So, how are you doing? It's good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. Cute. Alright, so I am controlling Chris, then. Okay. So, let's go. Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? Now I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Um... You know what? No. I'm gonna protest that shit. That was hey, very rude. Cut it out, man. Yeah, I mean, if you're not gonna bang her, maybe Mike will take up the case. Wait, will you back off her? Relax. Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. Yeah. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? Josh is a you very strange and Ashley boy. Alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Yeah, all right. Yeah, okay. Maybe you're right. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. 
<laughs> alright, alright, I got it. Jeez. That's so creepy, dude. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? Um. Didn't say I had a plan. Mm. Sounded like you had a plan. Nah. You better deliver, Cochise, or else you got four lovely ladies who are going to be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. <laughs> oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. No, no, they don't. Is there anything I can do over here? Hmm. What's this? Clue found. Axe holder. What? Okay, so that's something to do with the twins going missing, right? Hmm. Fascinating. Damn, Damn I'm getting pretty low on juice here. I just had to turn off my GPS. I'm finally, like, outside, or I might actually use it. Can you cool it on the phone, Tom? <laughs> what? Why? It's pretty much all you talk about. Well, you know, I mean, I can do all this stuff. And... Well, you got an app that can get us into the lodge? That would be nice. You got an app that can get you laid? What is it with this you, guy you getting don't. laid? The answer is that you don't. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. All right, let's push this thing. I can only push it a little bit at a time. Come on, I'm not a big macho man. Chris is not a small dude. I think he can handle it. Well, all right then. Ooh, that sounded like it hurt. Oh, I'm okay. Should have paid more attention in climbing class. <laughs> you mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Okay. Whoa. Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this. A lighter, really? This is my light source now? Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Your ideas yeah? have been shit totally. so far. What, what is it? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that. With the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant gonna help? <laughs> Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I gotcha. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye bye, frozen lock. Bingo. Oh, there you All go. Right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. <laughs> Gods. That guy is so weird. Okay. So, this is creepy as all hell already. So... What's this? Oh no, it's a totem. It's a totem! What's it gonna be? Yellow. Oh shit! Oh, it's loss. Was that Emily? That was Emily, wasn't it? I'm gonna go back and rewatch that. That was. Yeah, that was that was definitely Emily. Um. Okay. So anything. What? Okay. So that anything that might involve her getting lit on fire, I should probably avoid. Uh, okay. These controls are so shit. I see another glinty thing. What is it? Huh. That's cool. Clue found. Family portrait. I don't see how that's a clue. What was that? What the hell was that? I heard a door. Not so much like in this. Shit's getting real now. What am I doing? Alright. So.
so I hear whispering and I am not appreciating it very much I'm hearing voices and whispering it's really freaking me out hi Chris very funny oh how'd you know it was me shouldn't you be like Getting the lock open or something? On it. <laughs> All right, so why? I am hearing breaking now. No power. None whatsoever. That's Really helpful. Oh, this is spooky. Um, alright, so... Bathrooms. I'm looking for bathrooms. Can't I just open one of these doors? What's that? Can I light one of these? Because that would be useful for lighting. I do not like... The sounds I'm hearing right now. Not one bit. One new message. New message. Hi, Mrs. Washington. This is Sergeant Tate again. It's bad news, I'm afraid. Yeah, we've been through the case files, and there's nothing we can do. He's a free man. We don't have the legal power to restrict his movement. Uh, I know it's not what you wanted to hear, so hmm. call me if you want to know more. Is that that Victor Milgram guy? End of messages. Okay. So, bathrooms are most likely upstairs, so... Oh, what's this? Aww. It's a prom picture. How cute. Alright, so I'm not much liking the, uh, the sounds I'm hearing. That's kind of... Oh, is that what it is? Is it a window open? That's, that's the sound I've been hearing. Okay. That's a little less threatening. But how did the window open? I need a bathroom here. Oh Christ, that's dark. What is that sound? Ooh, hot tub. Very nice. Oh. Look at that. Bingo. <laughs> oh, you dick. scared the shit out of me! <laughs> Holy crap! How did that just not set the door on fire? Yeah, it's hot, dude. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. <laughs> <laughs> crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby wolverine. That was a wolverine. Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. How did it even get in there? Probably that open window, actually. Dumb question. Home sweet home. <sighs> sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. Well, yeah, no one's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? Not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Ew. Hey! Oh, shit. Oh, there's gonna be a fight. Make yourself at home, bro. 
Will do. Yeah. Come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Whoa. Easy there, cowboy. Hmm. Warn or challenge? I mean, I don't have any proof that there was anything illicit going on. They were just hugging. Um... You know what? I'm just gonna warn him. Final warning. Mike, stay away from our girlfriend. Dude, what are you talking about? Stay away from Emily. Emily? Why would I want anything to do with Emily? Hmm. Attack or back off? This is tough. You know what? I'm gonna attack him. Quit being such a dick, man. Nobody wants you here. Seriously, what's your problem, oh, meathead? Bitch! Hey! Hey! Get off me! Hey! Ooh. What the hell is wrong with you two? We didn't come back here just to tear each other's heads off. I mean, we came back here to have a good time, right? Hey, Mike, why don't you and Jess go check out the guest cabin I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, cool. And there's Emily. You wanna head up there? Sure. This is gonna be an awkward conversation, isn't it? So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember? Next to the Italian shoe place where I got the <laughs> stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean... She was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Listen, Why bitch. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Yes. Oh, do I you? Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm. We can get very warm. Eh, that's a little creepy. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, so I gotta try to not okay. get Emily killed. I'm gonna take a bath. Good idea, girl. <sighs> Exiled. Sexiled. Really, Jess? <laughs> Works for me. Oh, bar. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest, the most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. Yeah, okay. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. I have a feeling it's not. Away, maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars. You're gonna need these. Porn stars? I'd pay to see you. Uh, Ew. Gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? <laughs> really? What? No. <laughs> She actually thought he was being serious. I feel like she was actually hoping he was serious. Oh my. Alright, so I'm finally playing as Mike. Don't want to, because he's a meathead, but that's alright. Hey, Hot Lips! Photo booth? Alright, read my mind. Hot Lips? Really? Hot lips. That's what they went with? Oh, I can take selfies? Cute. Oh my god. Adorable. <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You're like you the most mom. annoying you girl in the game handy, so far. Maybe I'll let you start my portfolio at the cabin. Wink. Noted. He is such a tool. Oh my god. <sighs> Burr, it is freezing out here. Well, no shit. That's it's snowing. I can help you with. And how are you gonna do that? 
Uh, I got a few things in mind. Awkward. Okay, walk in, walk in, walk in. Something tells me this is not gonna end well. What now? So, what the heck was all that muscle flexing back there with you and Matt? Um. You know what? Evasive. Ah, you know, just. He's as much of a action dick as I think he is. Oh, really? That was all just to impress me? Well, you gotta <laughs> show off the goods when you got them. <laughs> oh, God, okay. I'm gonna vomit. You seemed pretty PO'd there, stud. Alright. Okay. I'll be honest. Dude was getting all territorial around M. What, am I not allowed to talk to her now that he's screwing her? Free country. Okay, generator. Huh. Great. This thing needs juice or something. Didn't Josh say there was a generator? Yes, I'm assuming it's this way. Since there's no other place to go. Oh, it's a totem. What's it gonna be? I wish you could generate a little excitement about getting that freaking generator oh. to work. Okay, I'll, I'll just yell at it like you're yelling at me. Let's see if that works. Christ, that was Ashley, wasn't it? That was a scary mask. All right. Let's see. What the hell just happened? All right. Do I really have to QT all this crap? Boom. Nice one, Mikey. There we go. Pull on it. There we go. Boom. Oh, you are a wizard. No, I just have thumbs. Oh, Jesus. Okay. This isn't going to end well. Jump scares galore. Holy crap. I am halfway through yet. Alright. Zam! The gates shall open. Woohoo! Pretty good, right? Yeah. Totally. No, that's just awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hit. Nice butt, girl. This girl's such a ditz. Anyway. You psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. It's like a little adventure. A sexcapade. Oh, God. Even he thought that was bad. That's saying something. So far, he's been one. He's had some pretty shit one liners, hasn't he? What now? From Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. Yeah, I'm gonna be respectful. Well, wherever they are, I'm sure they're happy we're all thinking about them. That's a nice way of thinking about it. Yeah. Plus, he probably feels a little bit guilty about the fact that he was part of the prank on Hannah the night she vanished, so, um... I feel like he would want to, I don't know, repent for that, so to speak. What was that? Um, did you hear that? Nope. I, I didn't hear a thing. Something. Yeah. That was scary. What the fuck? That was some kind of screech. Damn. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with the half block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, aka wax museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. You know what? Fuck it. We're adventurous. We will find- Whoa! Ah! Jess! Ooh. Fuck! Hey, Jessica! Yep. Hey. I'm okay. Holy crap. You <laughs> <scared> <laughs> that you looked really can't. funny. Oh. You didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Seven? Uh, 
I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. Hmm. Cautious or heroic? Hmm. Hmm. Heroic. Alright, coming after you. Just stay put. Oh! Hey, handsome. Wanna help me move this cart thing? Sure. together. This is not what I pictured. <laughs> <sighs> oh boy. This is not going so good. Creepy minds. Awesome. At least I have a flashlight. That's all I care about at the moment. No. That would have been bad. Uh, oh my gosh, are you okay? Uh, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> what is that sound? Oh, Nelly. This place is giving me the willies. And not the good kind of willies. There's a good kind of willies. Give you a little comfort and reassurance. <laughs> We'll save it for the cabin buster. I have no idea if I'm going the right way. I'm probably not. I'm doing some uh, exploration and shiz. <laughs> Christ Almighty! You all right? Yeah. Close one. I don't think this place is up to code. Yeah, I'm thinking it's time to go. It's probably a good idea. What's this? Blue Jesus. Town. This place is a real fixer rubber. Alright, so danger, danger, danger. Awesome. I feel like I'm not going the right way, but what can you do? Come on, Jess, move your ass. Please be the outdoors. Finally. Thank oh, God. Help. Just a little one, though. Yay, we're outside again. The question is, where are we outside? Oh, there we go. Awesome. Why am I veering so far off course? There we go. These controls are definitely taking some getting used to. Oh, I walk so slow! Well, well. When Josh said cabin, I felt like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, really? Are you planning on getting presidential on me? Oh my god, just stop. Right on Air Force One? <laughs> Alright, alright. Save for the stump speech, buddy. Oh, a telescope! Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. Um, whoa. Alright. I just saw someone at the cabin. What? Let me see. Christ! fuck was that? Are you serious? That was cheap. Hey, Jess? Mm-hmm? Stay close by, okay? What's up? Uh, this posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Oh, Michael, I have the best idea. What? Let's go hug a bear. What? Come on, please. The fuck Come is on. wrong with this girl? Let's not hug a bear. <laughs> Ugh, good lord, she's stupid. Like, painfully stupid. 
Oh, right, I gotta do the good old R2 button to do anything. Okay. <sighs> Not liking the music. Ooh, dear. It's so pretty. Oh my god. You son of a bitch. Watch out for a frame. Jump scares. Ugh. Stuff. Shut She's up, bitch. Gross. But diseases and shit. Ah, <laughs> oh, so many jump scares. Jump scares are such a cheap way to scare someone, but they work. before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half-empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. <laughs> They're gonna, like, die. Oh, boo! Show off! You throw that snowball at me, girl! You got something on your face! And I will hurt ah. you. Boo! How did he not see that coming? Okay. Okay. Well, that's how it's gonna be! Yes? Uh... Yes! Oh, shit. Um... Alright. That doesn't sound too good. Sammy! What? You wanna help me get this fire going? Uh, well... I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, do you need any help with that? I already <laughs> are! Come on. Alright, Josh, let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. Probably not. Isn't the room the friggin' Wolverine was in? It definitely is. Where am I even going? I'm going this way. Oh, Christ. Um, was that creepy? That's what it was. Ah, fuck it. I'm gonna go this way. There's a thing. I found a thing, and there's butterflies. How nice. Tattoo artist. Butterfly. Oh, that's the tattoo Hannah had. <gasps> All Hannah stuff. That's eerie. Really want to go poking through that? <sighs> that's so sad. It's actually a really nice room. Party. Dear Hannah, I would be delighted if you could attend my awesome party at 7 p.m. on the 13th of July at the location of Casa de Mike. Gee, Hannah. Crush much? A little bit. So, as I recall, Sam was Hannah's best friend. this. Hello? Could this be any more about Mike? Maybe. 
It's like a tear out from Cosmo or something. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I didn't want to do that again. Okay, I think I've seen everything there is to see in here. Potentially, that's a very nice bed. Is there anything over here? Yep. Hannah, Josh, and Beth, you invited to Sam's Halloween party, October 31st, 2013. Fancy dress obligatory. Hey, it's that picture! It's that picture that the, um, psychiatrist guy showed to me. Uh, how does he factor into all this crap? There is too much creepy noises. I English so good. I can't go this way? Alright, fine. I see how it is. What? Oh, there we go. Oh, masks. Explore, or should I just go downstairs? I'll explore. I can't explore. Okay. Thank you for shattering my hopes and dreams, game. All right, Tina Gallery. You know what? I got an idea for you too. There we go. Okay. Well, I'm pretty sure that somewhere in this crazy place we used to have a spirit board. Oh no 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 no! Spirit board? <laughs> bad bad yeah, news. Don't do it. Those things are a joke, man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and... Well... Hey Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. Well, you go do that. I'm not hey, doing you that. You guys, see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Oh, yeah, totally. Um, okay. Guess so. Brad. You're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? Alright, so I'm gonna end this episode here. Um, I'm gonna pick up in the next part right from here because I'm gonna start filming it now. So thank you all for watching, and until next time, this is Semantics signing off. Bye!